Hello dear dreamers, welcome to today's video, where I will show you how I turned an old and useless tire into something everyone would love to own. This tire needs a serious wash, so that's what I'm starting with. Using water and degreaser, I will scrub it until it looks like new. It's summer, the weather outside is perfect, I love summer. But it's time to move to the workshop to continue with the project. I start by cutting some planks dismantled from a wooden pallet. I'm not going to bother pulling out the nails, I cut them directly with the grinder. In the workshop, everything I need is at my fingertips. The surface is pretty rough, so I'm taking the sandpaper and I'm going to smooth it out. I've removed all the rough edges and it's time to talk about my idea. I plan to make three shelves to put in the tire and make a nice cheap bookcase. But even with the first shelf I had a problem. Am I wrong in the calculations? Let me try some heavier measurements. And finally, the first shelf went in. Two more to go. Of course, it will need more planks, measuring, cutting and sanding. I'll be careful with the measurements this time. Let me mention that the project is extremely cheap. The planks are from old pallets, while the tire was thrown away. So the cost of the whole project comes down to that of the optional components. The third shelf is the shortest and will stand in the lowest point. It is time to drill the tire and install the screws that will hold the shelf in the tire. But before that I have to install the only thing I pay money for this project. My tire got dirty again. And this is of course an RGB strip. What kind of bookcase would this be if it doesn't light up? Oh, 
I take into account that the inscription on the tire is on top. At bottom I will hide the controller and power supply. I plan to go around the entire tire once. Wow, I even have strip left over for a future project. I should have checked the strips before I stick it on, but I'm lucky and it works. I arrange the shelves and begin to fix them. First, I make pilot holes so that the planks do not crack. I repeat the same action on the other side of the tire. Four screws per shelf, I think is enough. If you like the work I do, you can subscribe to the channel. Click the bell so you don't miss a new video. You can also leave a comment. It will help the channel a lot. Don't forget about the like button. <laughs> I will use this shiner to make the tire look like new. From metal I make a plate with which the tire will be attached to a wall. I use an 8mm bolt for fixing. I do some rough measurements and drill. Perfect. And the remote works, so everything is fine. I 
could have painted the shelves, but since it's for the workshop, I decided to leave them as is. I painted the letters on the tire to make them stand out. I think it's turned out great. I will also paint the screws heads black to match the tire. That was from me, Dreamers. I'm Crash from Dream About Anything. I will wait for you again in the next video. See you soon.